Aw, shit. It appears we may see Pyramid Head once again. Movie news starts now. This is DSU News with Shane Nasty, baby! Return to Silent Hill. Looks like it's that time to go back to that scary-ass town once again. And director Christoph Gans, who directed the first Silent Hill live-action film, is back for this one. And just a heads up, we won't be seeing this one until about 2024 or 2025. Because currently they're in pre-production, looking for their cast and whatnot. But the good news is, the script is ready to go. Uh, Here's a quick synopsis of the movie, though. Driven by the shadows of his past, James Sunderland returns to Silent Hill to find his lost love, Mary Crane. But the dark, depressing small town is no longer the place from his memories. He meets characters who seem all too familiar and who try to divert him from his search for Mary. The longer he searches for Mary, the more he begins to wonder if this is still reality or has he fallen into the dark underworld of Jacob Crane. Konami, the company who creates the games, released a video where Gans actually gets into a little more detail about the project. And I'll leave a link in the description below so you can check it out. But here's some more details about the movie. It's said that the story will borrow from the Silent Hill 2 game and the idea of the myth of Orpheus and whether man can go deep into hell to bring back the soul of a person he loved the most in his life. It's also said that it'll be more more of a psychological horror movie and be set in modern times, but also be very true to the video game. In terms of the monsters we'll see in the game, one of the producers was quote saying, the monsters are also one of the key elements that the fans are waiting for, obviously, right? And we are updating those in a way that the creation is similar, but will be very striking. They also revealed that Pyramid Head will return in the sequel. And we'll see some new redesigns for monsters that'll give the audience that wow effect. Shay Nasty. This all sounds pretty promising to me. Now, I don't know a whole lot about the games. I know very little bit, I should say. But I do know someone who does, and they are probably freaking out right about now hearing this news about this new movie coming out at some point. Now, I've watched the past two movies, and honestly, the first one was really good. Enjoyed that one. Second one... Ugh, kind of sucked, but hey, let's. The good news is, Gans did not direct. He didn't direct the second one, only the first one. So, that's a good thing. So, but yeah, overall, I'm pretty intrigued about the news, though. I like the fact that Gans is, you know, going back to using elements from the game and implementing them into the movie. And I'm sure fans are excited for this. I, I would assume, at least. I mean, it's been a long time since the last game came out. It was like early 2000s or the last movie, excuse me. And you know, that's the thing, though. So, Silent Hill, to me, in my opinion. It's what Resident Evil would have been if it were a psychological horror game. But anyhow, can't wait for a trailer, which will probably be a while while from now. But in the meantime, I have some movie rec. I have a movie recommendation. uh, One actually from Christoph Gans' movie library, and it's called Brotherhood of the Wolf, or as they say in French, Les Pacs des Loups. I know I said that bad, but hey, give a brother a break. Yeah, and this one came out in early 2000s. And it's an, it's an action flip with horror elements. It has some great fight scenes and beautiful cinematography, dude. The transitions are just nastiness at its finest, I'm telling you. A highly underrated film that deserves to be seen by the likes of you. It's available on YouTube for my salt to buy or rent. And if you check it out, the fight scene at the end is nastiness at its finest. Trust me, when you see it, you know what I'm talking about. Anyhow, hey, that's all for today. Stay nasty, my friends, and I'll see you at the next one. Shay Nasty out. I'll see you soon. Like and subscribe. Like and subscribe.